you know, something that I've I've seen you discuss before are some of the the major lies of the green movement and just how easy it is to debunk those. So can you, you know, walk us through a few of those that you think are the some of the most important talking points that really expose the fallacy of the entire green movement? Well, they're arguing that human emissions of carbon dioxide drive global warming. There's just one slight problem with that. No one has ever proven that human emissions of carbon dioxide drive global warming. It's never been shown. And I have asked many scientists, including a former chief scientist of this country, just give me half a dozen scientific papers that prove that human emissions of carbon dioxide drive global warming. It can't be done, and it hasn't been done. Now, horror of all horrors, assume that I'm wrong. Assume that you can prove that human emissions of carbon dioxide drive global warming. Then you also have to prove that the natural emissions, which are 97% of the total emissions, you also have to prove that the natural emissions don't drive global warming. So before the whole game starts, it's nonsense. The whole science that the human-induced global warming is based on is actually wrong. It's demonstrably wrong. My knowledge and experience is of past environments, going back to the beginning of time and looking at the past environments on planet Earth. In the past, we've had six great ice ages. Six out of these six ice ages started when we had far more carbon dioxide in the atmosphere than now. So how can carbon dioxide drive global warming? And past atmospheres had up to 20% carbon dioxide in the atmosphere. At present, we have 0.04% carbon dioxide. Uh, A very, very small amount of, of a trace gas is in the atmosphere. So we're being asked to believe that, and I use the word believe advisedly because that's a word of religion and politics. It's not a word of science. We're being asked to believe the traces of an emission of a trace gas into the atmosphere will change a whole planetary system, and this is contrary to everything we know from the past. 